So y'all just removed 10,000 coins from me before the streams even started. Okay. Okay, action. <laughs> Every time I try to start the video, something happens. Okay. Oh, y'all removed 10,000 more coins from me? I better start the video before I have zero coins. Action. Hey, farmers. It's me, your favorite farmer, Joe. Welcome back to the farm. In fact, this is my farm. Well, it seems to be our farm because before the video even started, y'all took oh my god y'all took twenty thousand coins away from me where did that go and uh did give me a thousand back which was lovely but i will say we have some more mods to work with and i'm about to get back at the chat if you've entered the skull cavern i've got to better make it to at least level 25 d okay i love skull cavern challenge because we started the skull cavern last time i have some corn to harvest here and then i will show you some of the new mods that we currently have going on i don't even remember at what point i'm at in the community center journey because i've also been simultaneously running a farm on my telephone my mobile phone android the hit video game Stardew Valley Android. I don't know where my dog is. Either. Oh, there he is! Okay, sorry, I'm getting, I'm getting back on the, uh, getting back on the saddle for this. We got a pet boggy. Thank you for the 100 coins. Uh, so first mod is I did install like an infinite, infinite chests, infinite chest capacity i thought i would treat myself to that since y'all keep taking money away from me this, yeah this is a horse oh and we can also encounter wild animals now i forgot about that so there are now god this one just looks just like me now <laughs> this, this looks this looks just like me when i put on that green color correcting concealer now so there's wild animals occasionally. I think there's ostriches sometimes and also maybe some deer down here. I don't know what that is. I don't know what those are because squirrels already exist and those things were very large. Can I do what now? There's some deer. I don't think you can interact with any of them. You can't talk to them. No. And then there is a new item just get off the horse. There's a new, which I'll show you after I kill this, that you guys have spawned. I did realize starting a brand new vanilla game on Android, how much y'all have actually helped me um, in obtaining materials and leveling up a lot faster by what y'all have been doing. Thank you for the thousand coins as well. So I didn't, I downloaded these example rings i can now wear up to eight rings by the way and via mods now these were some example companion following rings yeah it's still been a net good i have so many supplies i have so much everything i've got we really have a whole lot of resources thanks to y'all so it's been a, a net positive so there's a something can fly around me a game character can walk Oh, Chelsea, thank you for the 10,000 coins. Uh, I do appreciate it. Oh, that's fun. Oh, thank you for the pizza. <laughs> so this ring makes something walk behind me. And I thought that that's something we could call the chat. So are, are y'all ready for this? <laughs> so now I have a little frog companion. Well, he gets stuck sometimes who follows me everywhere. And I thought it could be representative of the chat. My little toads. <laughs> that's y'all causing trouble, not helping. <laughs> right, I think that's cute. Froggy and Boggy. So Froggy follows me wherever I go. I don't think Froggy can get hurt. I guess we'll find out because I'll go to the mines in a little bit. But Froggy follows me and you can get different companions that follow you as well. But I thought the default was just very cute. Okay, so here's the new plan as well. I'm going to move everything into this chest. 
What is that? Hmm. Do I need the corn for the... So I have a couple fish I need for the bundles. I think I just need to sell the corn. Why did I make corn? It's been a minute. And I'm actually going to move all the contents. See, now my chests are infinite. They'll continue scrolling. So I'm going to move everything over. I love this mod. I have to tell you, this is great. I don't remember why I kept wheat either. Is there an easier way to move it? Oh my god, and you can organize it? Okay, this is OP. You know what? I feel okay doing all this because I've already beat the game with no mods. If you need to check, you can go see my hit viral TikTok. I have a viral TikTok. In which I show my diamond farm on the Switch. Oh yeah, I'm going to become a mega hoarder now. Y'all hear those flies buzzing? Why isn't that working? Uh-oh. Okay, and I did a mod on the bin. PC I know, Triforce Nerd, it's so nice. These are some nice quality of life mods. So, um, do I need the corn? I don't remember why I was growing corn. But now the bin, you can get stuff back out of the bin as well. So if I wanted that Joja Cola, but, oh, never mind. You can't get stuff. <laughs> It shows you what you put in. What the fuck is this? Chest label, chest categories, resized chest. I think technically I can put everything into the chest now from any distance, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to continue having just my inventory full because I don't, I don't want to do that. That's still one thing I'll continue to do accurately. Wait, no, whoa, wait. How come I can't get stuff out of the chest? Why were the chests grayed out like that? Why couldn't I get anything out? Oh, okay. Oh, because it's showing me... I have to click on the whole chest. I got really scared for a minute that nothing was ever going to come back to me. Did you see the panic in my eyes? Oh, I'm frozen. Thanks. Thanks, y'all. Oh, Lelin, good. I'm glad. I'm glad you got it. So every time something bad happens to me, we just pretend that bog that froggy does it now. This is great. This is going to be so much fun. And I'm going to hook up that thing to it. And it's going to be so great. Oh. I've got all these. So oh, yeah, my workbench. I'll keep the workbench out. We'll just put the workbench right by it. Okay, now things are working. Before, my mouse was snapping up there. Surely nothing can go wrong while I'm using a whole bunch of mods. I don't think anything has ever gone wrong. When you're using a whole bunch of... What was that? <laughs> Not y'all putting me in darkness. I wonder if I can place something on top of Boggy. Froggy. That'll be great. Now I can craft whatever I want from this one chest. Oh yeah, this is the move. I don't need these chests anymore. I can technically put stuff in chests now and carry the chests with me without having to take the items out. But I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. We're going to... The one vanilla thing we're going to stick with is my normal inventory. Okay. What is this haircut? I can't even see it. But it looks like it's probably awful. Thank you. It is awful. It is. I can't tell what I watered. Anyway, y'all been playing Stardew Valley? What do y'all... <laughs> what do y'all think of... What do y'all like best about Stardew Valley? It is. It's awful haircut. We're not gonna... 
Wait, did the frog just make that noise? On the on my Android farm, I did do um, one year community turned on the one year. <laughs> I just went to a different screen and my hairstyle changed. I did a finished community center in one year thing. Oh, I love you, Harvey. What can I give you? A salad. Ugh. Harvey gets it. We're marrying Harvey. Can I hit Froggy with a pickaxe? Oh, it does make sounds. I actually can't. It won't let me use my weapon when I'm facing it. Thank you for the coal. Yeah, I can't even swing my... I can't swing my sword at it at all. All right, I have one of these, a sunfish. I need a tiger trout. Maybe we'll get some fishing done today. Y'all into fishing? Oh, I could go ahead and catch that largemouth bass. God, not this hair again. <laughs> Thank you so much for the National Lottery. I'm still too afraid to do Stardew Expanded. <laughs> Hindering me in the mines? You know what? That would be just like chat to hinder me in the mines. So I think Froggy is a very acceptable companion. <gasps> the Moonlight Jellies. Oh, thank you for the coins, Monica. Time to dig through the trash. Let's also have a look at this. Oh, thank you for the cookies. I need some good animal mods too. Like I really, oh, this is why I needed some gold corn. Okay. Some animal, uh, some things that makes the animals weird. You know what I mean? I want something that makes the animals weird. What changes in the game if you enable one year community center? Um, so there are certain things in the normal community center center bundles that you can't, that you don't have access to in the first year. And so that just makes it that everything they'll ask for will be available the first year. So yeah, like red cabbage, exactly what K Stump said. Thanks for upgrading my hoe. Here's another random animal. What is that? I don't know what that is. Oh, those are chipmunks. That's fun. Oh, and there's ducks. I think these were good additions. I think more. Oh, they honked. I think more animals was a good move. Not this. Not the Ronald McDonald hair. It's truly a honk moment. Okay. Yeah, this looks like Wendy's hair. It makes me want a square hamburger. <laughs> oh yeah, Wendy's, Ronald McDonald. Oh, I don't know what that is. I've never seen animals before. Don't do it, Maru. Oh, wow, the frog just keeps going, huh? Oh. I would like to get a largemouth bass. I think they're any, any time of the year, but we'll see. Oh, y'all did not just fucking do this. This is why we're never going to be able to fish in this game, <laughs> me up. Oh, oh, the sword will swap when the frog is there. I have to now make sure I'm not facing the frog 
<laughs> you really are. Y'all really doing this to me today. There's demons? Of course there's demons. Demons in my hit video game, Stardew Valley? Oh yeah, that's the bottom. We're Skull Cavern now. At least she gave me some nice bangs. Well, there they go. They're gone now. We'll work on love for today. I feel like I wasted the day showing the new mods. I think he would like cookies. I love Skull Cavern. The one thing... Are those guineas? Is that a guinea? I don't know what that is. The one of the things that I'm against is Skull Cavern Elevator. <laughs> Not this case, Stumps. Skull Cavern Elevator. I don't have time for that. I don't have time for that. Did I need that fish? I did need that fish. We're gonna put the corn in there. Actually, I'm gonna take out my bombs for the Skull Cavern. I'm gonna sell a lot of this stuff today. I'm gonna sell the corn. I'm gonna keep the... It won't really let me drag it where I want it to go. There we go. Okay. Oh, I see the issue. There's some... Using controller with this mod is kind of doesn't work, so we're going to have to use the mouse with it. All right, I'm going to bed. You got to get staircases with Jade. Okay, we did have a say nice things about the chat from Pizza Detective Gab. Dear chat, if y'all were a frog that followed me around, you would let me swing a sword over your head to kill a um, <laughs> demon snake. Because you would trust that I would not hit you. <laughs> no, we would not. Y'all would trust. Yeah, you would. That's a good thing. Y'all would trust that I would not hit you. Oh my god, I can't even use the fucking watering can when the frog is there. Y'all would trust that I wouldn't hit you. Yeah, 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 y'all would. Yeah, y'all would. Oh my god, I hate the frog. <laughs> oh my god, the frog is awful. And that frog was also humping my crops. Okay, we're gonna despawn the frog in the skull cavern. And it's, it's not a reflection of how I feel about the chat. Okay? It's not necessarily a reflection of how I feel about the chat. It's just something that has to be done. I thought I said I needed the blueberries. I'm all mixed up because now... What y'all do? Because I need... Um, some of the stuff I need for my community center on my other farm. Okay. Sorry to this frog. It, not necessarily. Not necessarily. But could potentially reflect how I feel about y'all. My favorite way to make money in Stardew? I'm bringing two swords because I know y'all are going to take one of these away from me at one point. Favorite way to make money in Stardew? A diamond farm. Lots of diamonds. Old Sap, thank you so much. Oh. She's not here yet. I didn't realize it was so early. Okay, you can make Pam walk faster if you stand in front of her for a minute. Yeah, 
am I going to watch what? What's Goat Story? Is that a CGI? Were you telling me about Sailor Moon? Brit Steps, thank you for the bits. Good to see you. Old Sap, thank you for the bits. Called Head Shaving, which makes everyone bald. Oh, I like that. Yeah, everyone bald. Finally, my kind of town. I'm down with that. If you stand in front of Pam, she'll go over there faster. And I gotta go give Shane a pizza real quick. Oh, sh she caught me. <laughs> Shane, come back. She, she caught me digging through the trash. That's one thing you don't want him to catch you doing. He still kind of hates me, but I love him. So we'll deal with that later. We'll work out our feelings on that later. Tyler Bear with the 23 freaking months. Well, I'm glad you got to be here. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Farville, thank you for the bits. It adds more characters. Oh, it doesn't really change gameplay. Okay, I could deal with that. Joe Spacey with the 17 months. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, Farfield, thank you for the bits. Of course, putting the... <laughs> Are these armadillos? We're putting... Uh, yeah, battery in the tunnel. The whole Mr. Mr. Key thing. We're doing it. We do it all. I'm here for all of it. I don't know what that is. Oh, that's right. I cut down all the trees in the desert. I think that's a meerkat. I forgot I cut down all the trees in the desert for a while. I thought that was like a radish growing. All right. Sorry to this frog, but we got to take off the ring... Because that frog's going to get me killed. Not okay, deforestation. Is it deforestation if it wasn't a forest in the first place? If you cut down... If you cut down a tree when no other trees are around it, you're not deforesting everything. True or false? Ooh. <laughs> True or false? Not de desert station, but a desert does already doesn't have trees. <laughs> not, not because it's me. You're gonna say I'm at fault. I, I see y'all upgrading the weapon, but is the Yeti tooth better? How many trees does it take to make a forest? Can somebody Wikipedia that? What'd y'all do? Oh, maybe we'll get a dinosaur egg. Oh, ow, ow. That dinosaur, first of all, is stuck in the corner, which is great. <laughs> Not my warranty while I'm trying to kill a dinosaur. We didn't get an egg, did we? No, but we got some bones. Four? Are y'all looking that up or are you... Is that real? Frolic, thank you for the first time sub. Welcome. X marks the spot. Thank you for the seven months. Great to have you here as well. I appreciate that. <laughs> That, that slime is none of my business. Thank you for the pizza. All the pizzas are going to Shane. And not Harvey. If y'all ever give me the, the salad, those go to Harvey.
Oh. Making a joke, Shelby. We don't do that here. Oh, jokes. <laughs> Not I don't. Uh, Siren Inspects, thank you for the eight months. Brit Steps, thank you again for the bits. Runner1226, thank you for the bits. Wonder Girls, thank you for the 14 months. I do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. How much did y'all give me? Thank you for the 1,000 coins. Uh-oh. Buckle up, chat. Storms are coming. Storms are coming. We'll see if we live through this. I'm not, I can't back out. Oh, but they're all around me. <laughs> I backed out. Today was not the day for Skull Cavern. I changed my mind. Did you just call that thing Grimace? We do need the slime ring. We sure do. Okie, thank you for the beards. <laughs> I think the frog, the frog's a wonderful idea. Um, the frog's a wonderful idea, in theory. Poopy Farm's doing well. We don't really have to worry about money. Chat gives money and chat takes money, but I think we've made a net profit so far. Not this. I, my Tama emote. Y'all, they're, they're pulling you back into McDonald's with the Grimace, aren't they? Y'all have been sucked back in by the Grimace. Where does this shad need to go? Is that a skunk? Emerald. Oh, it's a chub. Y'all got a chub? Raise your hand if you have a chub. <laughs> Here he is. Raise your hand if you got a chub. Desertifi desertification? Hold back the... Oh, is the Sahara expanding? Happy Pride Month to your chub. I'll go fishing. Italian word of the day. Pazzola is skunk. Are skunks, do they exist in Italy? Are they native? Where was I? Do I like mulberries? I don't know what that is. I only know that from a nursery rhyme. Uh, Froggy Terry, thank you for the bits. All around the mulberry bush. Da, 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 da. That part? I don't know if I've ever had mulberries. That seems kind of like an old maiden type of berry. I'm not, I didn't even know they were real, for being honest. I thought it was a rhyme. I got my bass. 
That's like gooseberries. Nobody believes in those except British people. Elderberries. Okay, there are some people in the U.S. who believe in elderberries. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I gotta start using bait. <laughs> the, and let me tell you, if you live in the United States and you talk about elderberries, you're probably insufferable. In the UK, elderberries, just regular old chit chat. But if people in, in the US talk about elderberries, it's because they're trying to be cultured. Insufferable. <laughs> it's me, I'm insufferable. Not this. You tried to do that while I was fishing. Someone's a, someone. Guess we have a, a, an American who likes to talk about elderberries in here. Got mad. <laughs> Let me tell you about rhubarb. <laughs> Every single dish on Great British Bake Off is made out of rhubarb. I don't know if you know that about rhubarb, but every single dish on Great British Bake Off has rhubarb in it. An American and an American could not tell you what that flavor is. I believe it. From the description of it, it sounds delicious. Not bald. Ooh, bald purple. I like that. I would eat rhubarb. They have it at the Harris Teeter here, but I've never, I've never gotten it because I don't know how to cook it. Yeah, it does look like red celery. I think it... It probably is just red celery. You should spread that around. You should spread that rumor. I would. Of course, the lake fish bundle. Nice garbage. Anything else need to... Oh. I just thought I needed more stuff. Rhubarb's supposed to be like tart, isn't it? Isn't it tart? Isn't it tart? <laughs> Old Sap, thank you for the bits. Oh, not this. All right, I choose heads. Old Sap told me to choose head or tails. This will decide if you get a star drop or get one removed. All right, I choose heads. Thank you for the bits. Barfield, thank you for the bits. I, they patched out some glitches. I don't know if they patched out the underpants one. Gigi, thank you for the bids. The 1900s, the U.S. government put a ban on growing gooseberries and currants because they were blamed for carrying a blight that could affect pine and because pine was a major timber industry. Oh, my God. Someone wanted my... Elliot wanted my bass. I'll go catch... Ugh, it's too late. I'll, I'll catch him one tomorrow. So, I would... I think I would like it in baked goods. I like sour things. Something citrusy that cuts through. Oh, yeah. Isn't sour like a defense mechanism for the plant? I don't know about a rhubarb tart. I guess I've already sent those to the museum. I haven't that. I've already done mushrooms. I guess I don't need a carp either. This mod is making the mouse jump all over the place. Oh yeah, and I can get the stuff back out too. That's fun. How much money do I have right now? All right, don't take any money away from me. I'm going to crack open these Omni Geodes. Do I have any more Geodes? Wow. 
Materials. I wonder what geodes are filed under on this mod. Wow. Uh oh. What's the mod? This one is called like ex Chests Expanded or something. It's one of the top mods on Nexus Mod. You have to install a few to get it to work. Removed. Oh my god. Removed a star drop. Uh, we also have a say nice things about the chat from your Atoma girl. Dear chat. How do I accept this? Dear chat. If y'all were a Stardew Valley mod, y'all would be a helpful one that also puts bunnies into the world and you can just look at the bunnies. If you were a Stardew, I can do better. Oh my God, the dog, <laughs> Boggy. <laughs> Dear chat, if y'all were a Stardew Valley mod, y'all would be a a um what quality of life mod. That's what they call them. Quality quality of life. <laughs> and the quality of life would go up. Cause you would be something like, you know, the horse would poop and the you could use the fertilizer for uh eating or snacking. Uh, or actually not any, either of those things, but help the plants grow, is what I meant to say. <laughs> I would call Eggplant Horse a quality of life mod. Oh, is the corn fucking... Is the corn fucking? <laughs> Did I not pick that corn? I can't tell what... What food has done grown and what food had not done grown. All right, let's question the scarecrow. I've scared off two crows. I've scared off six crows. It's the hair. <laughs> Hello, that haircut scared off those crows, honey. Hello. Hello. Not the honk. I can sell that corn. All right. Shall we do a Skull Caverns Day or do you want to do fishing? Oh, it's Friday. Hold on. I got to go to the traveling cart. Mmm. I don't like that sprinkler. I don't. It's for next season. All right. We'll do Skull Caverns. <laughs> There's a wind mod. I don't know if it works on her her corn hair though. Do I need a strawberry? Oh, I love seafoam. I'm gonna take the trout. I think I already did an egg. That's a bargain for seafoam pudding. I'll take a few of those actually. Did I buy a dandelion? Okay, good. I, I, I have to buy things before y'all take my money away is really my plan of action in this game. I have to buy things because if I don't, I know y'all will take my money away. And that will upset me. This game does have a, tra a fast travel option. You get it later in the game. Um, I could have it right now if I were cheating, but I don't cheat. It, uh, on other versions of the game. Which means raccoon. Aw, oh, little washing bear. I love that. Hold on, hold on. Don't leave. No, what do you want? What the? I thought me and him. No, no, no. Have this granola. Oh, oh shit, shit. Okay, fine. I'll leave you alone. I thought he would like a granola bar. I wouldn't call an eggplant horse cheating. 
That's a visual mod. I would call uh, the chest thing cheating, though. Fiona Lofi, thank you for the 20 freaking months. I appreciate that so much. Good to see you. I'm glad you could make it. I would say crowd control in general is cheating. If I'm being honest. Oh, soapstone. I want that. What's that crystal I bought the other day? Celestine? Because I, I was in the store. I was in that store buying that fossil. And then I had seen uh, that other rock called Celestine. And I said, oh, I know that from Stardew Valley. And so I had bought it at the store. Because I remembered it from Stardew Valley. So once I get a Celestine, I'll have to put it on display. Not this Davi day. Um, Vincent RL, thank you for the 19 months. Good to see you. Hope you've been doing well. Thank you, thank you. Skull Caverns, is that what y'all wanted today? Alright, let's do it. I don't think I'll get very far. We should honestly start farming Jade or something. No, I'm not a crystal gay. Just one crystal and one fossil. That's all anybody ever needed. Glass with a fat ass. Thank you for the six months. Well, I'm glad you're here. It's good to see you. Eris in Wonderland. Thank you for the bits. Good to see you. Voodoo Sparkle Juju. Thank you for the bits. Yeah, chat's really put me through it, but it's been a net benefit. It's been an overall benefit, so we can't complain too much. They do like spawning the flying serpents, though, I'll tell you. Oh. I thought my thing was gone. Not please someone take all his money away. Oh, fell seven levels. Oh, mama. It's the mummies. Get away! They scare me. You gotta blow them up with bombs. I'm just... Shit. I'm just gonna avoid them till we can find a way out. ladder would be great. Anywhere a ladder wants to be would be great. If I were a ladder, I'd be under that one. Nope. I'd be under this rock for sure. Nope. Probably that one. Nope. If I were a ladder, I would be under this rock. Or this one. Or this one. Probably this one. Oh my god. Oh! I'm tumbling. Oh my god. Okay. We've been blessed with many holes today. What? Oh, no. What level am I? 22. Okay, good, good, good. We have been blessed with many a hole today. Um, B Brock, thank you for the 15 freaking months. Did I already say thank you? Thank you, thank you. I do appreciate it. Thank you for the invincibility effect as well. Um, and Cursper, thank you so much for the 25 freaking months. Good to see you too. I do appreciate that. Maybe we'll find a prismatic shard. I'm... I don't want to upgrade to the galaxy sword because part of me feels like y'all going to take that away from me too. Yeah. 
my hot bar setup, you have to have the food right next to your pickaxe? No, 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 no. This is, this is the way. This is the order. Sword, pickaxe, trash farming tools, because I hate farming. And then food at the end is fine. No, no, we're fine. No, 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 we're fine. This is the way. Now, I do need the frozen tear. That's right. All right. I'm gonna eat that fish whole. Eat your heart out, Mr. Key. Oh yeah, I forgot about Elliot. Oh yeah, I forgot about Elliot needing that bass. Oh! Give me a dinosaur egg. Mama? I want a dinosaur egg. Give me a dinosaur egg. Set me on fire. yet oh hell yeah mama we're in summer year one and we just got a dinosaur egg the haters are hollering i'll tell you that the haters are hollering Oh, Captain Maddie redeemed us say nice things about the chat, by the way. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. It looks like they're... Okay, dear chat. If y'all were an egg... Ah! If y'all were an egg, y'all would be purple? Oh... You would be purple, um, because you would be an egg from the dinosaur Barney. <laughs> there you go. Because Barney is purple. I'm going to eat this fish. But did you see they rebooted Barney? I think they rebooted Barney. Okay, looks like I'm going to have to kill these things to get a ladder. I'm not good at avoiding. Thank you for this. This is a nice blade. Oh, I'm getting a little nervous now. Yay, CGI or something. <laughs> that one took a lot out of me. Yeah, it's a pretty, it was a good one though. All right, dinosaurs. Dang, why don't I use this blade more? It's fast. All right, can I, ow, ow, can I please have a ladder or something? Do you have to kill all the dinosaurs on the dinosaur level? I haven't had a dinosaur level in ages. Oh, yeah, you sure do. It's like the infestation ones, huh? All right, ladder should be up here then. These things are none of my business. <laughs> not changing my hair color when I'm bald. Well, next time my hair appears, it'll be a different color. <laughs> you don't like Bar you just y'all do not watch without Barney, we wouldn't have Selena Gomez and Demi Lovato. Y'all, they got their starts on Barney. Are y'all saying y'all hate celebrities now? I watched Barney as a kid. I had a Barney hat and a Barney stuffed animal. Oh my fucking God. <laughs> All right, I have a plan for this level. Oh, this one's a little too much. I don't really like that there are this many and that I have to kill them all. 
I think we've hit an, uh, we've, we've encountered a, we've hit an impasse at the Skull Caverns for the day. I gotta tell you, oh, I was avoiding them really well. The, the dinosaurs were, uh, they heard us talking about Barney. They heard us talking about Barney. <laughs> Glass with a fat ass. Oh, wow, y'all just really removed 10,000 coins from me. Glass with a fat ass, thank you for the bits again. Not an orange egg, though. Not this smoke'em joke. Not licking the boots of celebrities. But I'll take their money, too, though. Salsa Senorita, thank you for the bits. Penos is what <laughs> Hmm, not the confused Pinos. Wouldn't that be so funny if I accidentally sold the dinosaur egg? That would be... That's so me. That's so me. Alright, what all of these things do I need? I don't need the fiddlehead fern. I can just sell a lot of this shit. I just thought I, I need that. Thought I needed it, but I sure don't need a lot of this shit. Okay. Gunther's gonna tell me about this. I need the bone fragments. I'm gonna keep them. I need that. Trash. No fern. And we'll dump some of this. We gotta get incubator. I hate that it's doing that to my mouse. I don't understand why it's doing that to me. Did y'all just take away a thousand coins, Razor Bunny Gemini? You can downgrade items. I'm gonna refine that quartz one of these days, and it'll be over for y'all. I haven't been using the bombs. I'm not carrying the bombs. We need to, uh... Actually do some nice things to the fishing. Oh, I like this hairstyle. It's Princess Leia. Not the six hour long nap. Mel the Magic Dragon, thank you for the bits. Not the blessed with holes. Not that. In the suburban mom bless this. Oh, not that. Not that cursive e font. Gigi, thank you for the bits. Children sing songs about hurting. I don't know. Why do y'all? Why do so many y'all hate Barney? Loved reading Rainbow. Loved reading Rainbow. Yeah, why do y'all so many of y'all hate Barney? I think I need the tomatoes anymore either. Uh, big comfy couch. That show was a jam as a kid. Whoa, 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 whoa. You did it. I'm very impressed. And oh, Mr. Key just gave me 10,000 G. The haters took it away. So, long story short, I need a fresh melon. Yeah, we'll see. The haters ate. And the food was rancid. The haters ate, and the food tasted like dookie dookie pie. <laughs> I never saw the bear in the big blue house. Wasn't that cable? Y'all can bankrupt me, but you have to pay me with real money to do it. <laughs> oh, 
that's what I was going to ask y'all about in the pre-show. I need um, tips on fake nails because we hit the su- we hit all the sub goals this month. So we're going to do Garctic Phone. I'm going to be doing some nail art, which I've never done before. And we're also going to show that that video of me from 2003. Um, I'm buying some fake nails and I just got these cheapy. I'm thinking of these cheapy ones on Amazon. They're like six dollars for a hundred press on nails glamnetic well that's great we're definitely going cheap static nails now what's static nails that sounds like there might be static in them static nails don't use nail glue okay i do just need to get press ons well i thought with a hundred nails I could do all 10 fingers and then use some of them for eyelashes. And then the rest cover my body with like an armadillo. Do you know? So no nail glue. <laughs> I'm not doing my fucking toes. Glam, okay, glamnetic. And what was the other one? Static? This is one thing I will actually write down. Static. Glamnetic. And LB. Here's another question. I don't... So, I have a very sensitive nose. And I also am afraid of the chemicals that nail polish smells of. It gives me a headache. And I... I'm not really into that vibe. It's not the vibe I'm catching. Um, vegan nail polish. I've looked at a few. Those have those don't have the smell though, right? I get I'll get a headache and I'll be trapped in this room with a headache. So I'm looking at other options. Vegan nail polish still smells. Now I did find this nail polish for children. Exclamation point CC with nothing else in your, uh, in the, in your chat. Get one for dogs. The seven free tends to smell less. Now here's my other question. Oh, I got this skeleton. That's fun. That's fun. So there's this stuff called, let me look at, let me look up the name because I was just looking at it. It's called piggy paint. 100% non-toxic. Um, radioactive. <laughs> no, no, no. Do I have to, I need a base coat in us. If I'm using press on nails and painting the press on nails. Do I need a base coat or I'll just need a sealer? You have the piggy paint stuff? Let me, okay. Strawberry's gonna go sniff some nail polish for me. <laughs> that one seems like it's like for, it's like, I don't, I don't know. I didn't read the whole thing. Well, yeah, and Piggy is also the name of my dog. So that's great too. Yeah, I would want a clear, a clear one for the top coat, right? I've never done my nails before. Just use regular nail polish and a top coat. Okay. A clear top coat. Okay. Oh, thank you for the cookies. I don't remember where I need this thing, but I need this thing. Use press-ons, you don't even... No, no, but that's the whole point of it, is, that, is to do nail polish on stream. We're doing nail art. I'm getting things... I'm getting this $8.99 nail art kit that comes with the things that you use to pick up the stickers and place them on your nails. Jewels. They have jewels. They have stickers. They have little shiny things. They have foil. $8.99. Yeah, that's the whole point of it. 
$8.99. Don't, oh, so don't go with static or, okay, so you lied to me is what you did, okay. Regular nail polish usually... I thought it did, though. I thought that was the whole thing about nail polish, is it was so smelly. I will not be making a dress out of press-on nails. I think that's... Well, yeah, that's definitely already been done. Drag race. And then also... I need to talk to him. Cookies? Cook cookies. A tux? No. Whenever I've been in a nail salon, I get such a migraine. And I'm... And I don't want to be locked in the room and the room smelling like that. Me and my sister are both very sensitive to smells. So I'm going here to get, I want a, um, an earth gem real quick. I don't think I have one saved. I gave my only one to Gunther. So I'm looking for an earth gem. That's why we're back in the crappy mines. Just letting y'all know what's up. I could also kill slimes while I'm here, I guess. The acetone. I thought nail polish smelled awful because one time Trixie Mattel was doing her nails in a diner and Katya talked about that once. Tea on piggy paint. Hardly has a smell and the smell is different. Co coverage is rather sheer. Well, I'm okay with sheer coverage. I am okay with sheer coverage because I think most of the design will be the art, the glitter and stuff I'm going to be putting on top of it in a beautiful way. I'm going to be doing it in a beautiful way. I see the ladder. I just want to make sure there's not a, an earth gem down here or whatever. I think the sheer will be okay. Uh, Farfield, thank you for the bids. Acrylic paint and acrylic markers and use Mod Podge if you want unscented. Really? For nails, CVS Kids section or Claire's? Uh, no, I think, th yeah. Farfield said nail polish does smell awful, especially for people not used to it. I get migraines from nail polish. Smells not acetone. Chat out here trying to gaslight you. I just say this might be the first time I agree with Fartville. And I'm just out here saying it. Might be the first time we're on the same page. <laughs> The, yeah, I would imagine the U, the UV bulbs. No, I'm afraid of. I'm really am afraid of nail polish. Non-traditional materials, pigments instead of usually. Okay, I'm I might look into some non-traditional because what we really need. So the art is going to be what it is. It's art. I have glitter to mix with things. I have stickers. I have, um, my mouse was moving. Oh, shit. I have glitters, I have stickers, things, fun things to put on the nails. But then I'll need to do a top coat of some kind, I would think. And maybe add a little color to it. I might try the, the piggy paint stuff. If that's sheer, then that's okay, because I'll get I'll get the white nails, and then we'll just kind of make them sheer, add glitter. 
Wait, wait, wait. When I heard Mod Podge, I thought of marshmallow fluff. First of all, I love marshmallow fluff. I could eat a whole can of it. Well, I could put Doritos in the nail polish, and that's nail art, too. We're really not finding any. The earth gems just sit out, but I haven't even seen any just out and about. Yeah, Doritos. A town in Massachusetts not shutting up about their marshmallow fluff. It makes good fudge, though. I will say, use marshmallow fluff for making fudge. Mm, good idea. Mm, good idea. The best idea. Hollow Taco is top tier. I don't know what that is, but we're also going for more like bottom tier. But the tier we're aiming for is significantly lower than top. Not this. I'm out. <laughs> Me using the wrong tool for that was my sign to leave. If you use regular paint on black press-ons, you can take the nail off when done. Since chat was asking how to remove acrylic and... Oh, thank you, Fartville, for the bits again. I do have Mod Podge, so I can just use Mod Podge as my top coat. We shouldn't try water marveling, though. That's a definite no, we shouldn't try water marble in. There's one. Oh, so close. <laughs> That's when there's like an image on top of the water and then you have to go up through the water. Is it not? Water marble of Furby? I don't think that's how Furbies work. And if one more, well, if y'all sends me the thing about the new Furbies. <laughs> Actually, not as many people as should have sent me the article about the new Furbies. Because it's only been like three of y'all and I would have expected at least ten people to send me the article about the new Furbies. So actually, what have y'all been doing? Thank you, Shelby. Do they even have moving mouths? I generally, genuinely can't tell if their mouths move. Oh, we do have one of the fast travel options now. The mine carts will be moving. That's true, Casey, you did your duty. Sam also texted me about them. What'd he call me? What'd that Junimo call me? <laughs> oh, not all the rats outside the community center. It's too, it's too li few of y'all. For sure, for this one. Do you not have my phone number? I think all the mods have my phone number. But I don't know if I ever gave it to you. <laughs> we'll get you my phone number. We gotta get you my phone number. The mods need to have my phone number. We didn't... We, um, what's it called? We expediated your onboarding process. You never owned a Furby? Honestly, your life's probably better for it. 
I'm going to save this rib because I think I need it once I get to Ginger Island. Wait a fucking second. Did I already have a fucking earth... <laughs> Alright, I already had an earth crystal. So... That was a day wasted. I'm going to put her next to my bed. I was too caught up talking about, um... Nails. We'll put this down here. This is not really fun until I have the whole thing. Is that the back of it or the middle of it? I was just waiting to see. We'll buy a chicken coop when we get a chicken coop. Do you want me to buy a chicken coop? I haven't been focused on animals. Okay, chat. Would you rather have... <laughs> Thank you, cat. A cow barn or a chicken coop? And we'll go do that tomorrow if I have enough wood and stuff. I just don't really bother upgrading the house and stuff. Also... I've been seeing how long it would take y'all to notice that I have chosen to not put the frog back. <laughs> that, I ch that I found the frog annoying and I have not re-implemented it. <laughs> not that, Chelsea! They do work hard, but only at night. Oh! Oh, does the new one have an off switch? Um, I don't know, Hot Day Corn Dog. I know that it's. Why does Shane have a blue? He just, like, breeds blue chickens or something. I just learned how to make a maki roll. That's so me. Robin's begging me to build a chicken coop. I need gold corn. That doesn't seem to be happening. Once I get the greenhouse, I'll try for gold crops a little better. I'm not doing a good job. I love that y'all fully downgraded my watering can in the last episode, and there's been nothing new with that. Oh, interesting. I never played... Uh, Ocarina of Time. Thank you for the upgrade in the watering can. I do appreciate it. I do appreciate it. Those of you on YouTube who keep seeing me push this button over here. We're, de we're doing a portable air conditioner this summer. The real air conditioner's out, and we're not getting a new one till like, fall. So we've got a window thing hook up right here. Then I'm turning on and off manually every once in a while. Oh, okay. How much is a chicken coop? Chicken coop. Stardew. Three hundred wood, one hundred stone, and four thousand dollars. Okay, if y'all take my money away from me, we can't get it. Where's the wood? Okay, how much wood? Three hundred. One hundred stone. Do I gotta clear a spot for it? We'll just put it here. This farm's not really about aesthetics. And 
And we'll take the horse there. I'm not going to use the mine cards, I don't guess. Oh, there's probably room. We'll be fine. I'd rather find out the hard way. Oh, Heather, thank you for the bits. Good to see you. If I could have any CC perk, what would it be? It would be to give me Iridium. Not Iridium. Um, Prismatic Shards. Or are we like doing a dream one? Prismatic Shards, but the ones that exist? Star Drop. Oh, yeah, plenty of room. We can move buildings later as well. Oh, God, what'd y'all do to my hair during that conversation? Available ones? Star drop. I'm ready to gobble gobble up all the star drops in this game. What are you copying and pasting, cat? Sugar turtles, thank you for the bits. What have we done so far? When I tell you not much, would that surprise you? Fartville, thank you for the bits. I don't remember a rare yellow hawk. That's not something that I've stored in my memory. I don't need the peppers either, do I? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know about this copy-paste. Wait, hold on. Oh, thank you for the star drop, by the way. <laughs> Old Welsh witch. I don't even remember half of the time how you legitimately get star drops in this game. This is the only mod I think I need. And this whole thing. Oh, Heather, thank you for the star drop too. I appreciate that. Wow. I'm feeling more energetic. My character is really vibing today. That's not nice. someone took away one earlier in the stream. Uh, Glass with a fat ass. Thank you for the bits. I've not seen the B movie, but plenty of people here love to talk about it. But plenty of people in this chat will be happy. Oh, I'll get some. No, I won't get pepper poppers. A net positive. Hey, Kezia! This chat loves talking about the B movie. Oh, I saw a real woodpecker the other day. The next sub goal is absolutely not the B-movie. Isn't it Jerry Seinfeld? Brit Steps, thank you again for the bits. I appreciate it. Catch three sardines. No thanks. Whose birthdays are it? Oh, it's the dwarf's birthday tomorrow. Or the next day or something.
I will. I'm. I have no desire to watch the B movie. That's not what's happening. I thought there was a. Oh, is it in the crafting section? All right, Paul. How many people have seen the B movie? Is the Beeb movie like Toy Story for Gen Z? No, it's fully millennial. B movie is so painfully millennial in the worst ways. Did I just get all this shit and not need it? I should check this. It says I need to put this goat milk somewhere. The game says the goat milk's going somewhere. Probably up here. animal bundle okay some kind of big eggs a large egg and a duck egg I'll have the fruits to put in that one okay yeah them quality crops are gonna fuck me up Oh, shit. Oh, okay. So this whole thing gives me the greenhouse, so I can't rely on the greenhouse to get the quality crops. You watch the B movie on Tumblr? Uh, Glass with the Fat Ass, what do you mean by I would give Joe so much money to watch the B movie? How much money is so much? Because everyone has a price. How much would it take? I asked first. <laughs> Where's Harvey? I asked first. We need to start a poll where we vote for Joe to watch the... That's not how polls work, like, at all. The polls are... don't force me to do anything. <laughs> the polls don't make me do anything. Dried starfish. That's my butthole. <laughs> It's a horse. It's an eggplant horse. Oh, this is one of the new little animals. That was actual, actually real. Dried starfish. Raise your hand if that's your butthole. <laughs> Pole to make Joe listen to polls. I, I just don't know how anyone could think that a pole around here is anything more than fun. We're here to have fun, and that's about it. I don't know when polls became legally binding in some of y'all's brains. Oh, I finally listened to Padum Padum. I did do that. Kylie Minogue. It was fine. It was fine. I see why people like it. Did I gag? No. But it was good. It was good. I can see why that's like a hot summer song. But I don't like any music. That's not me hating on the song. That's me hating all music. The only song I listen to is Everywhere by Michelle Branch. It's the only song I listen to. Have you ever seen a horror movie? I've seen hundreds of horror movies. Not did you quake. Isn't the rainbow shell what I give to the old man when it rains and he gives me a wedding ring? 
I don't remember. Did you see how fast I got y'all to talk about something other than B-movie? Did you see? Oh, thank you for the watering can upgrade. Y'all don't even remember B-movie existing at this point. Yeah, sugar turtles, yeah. He doesn't just give it to you, though. You have to trade him something, do you not? He shows up on rainy days. I've got the bridge fixed. I <laughs> know this. Thank you, sugar turtles. I appreciate it. Yeah, I think it's the rainbow shell. Oh, Monica, it's just in the settings. It's just in your, like, Twitch profile settings. And I think you can only change it every, like, six months or something. I don't remember. It's follow-up question. What are you going to change your username to, Monica? She sure is over there making a racket. Every 60 days. Oh, okay. I think there's supposed to be a thunderstorm today in real life, and I'm very excited about it. You will all still know it's me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So does, Kat, is your mental health hinging on whether or not I like Shakira? I just want to know before I answer the question. I see you keep asking about Shakira. <laughs> not this. Class was fast. I don't even know what I'm doing in this game right now. Because y'all are so chaotic. I'll probably go back to the Skull Cavern. Oh, thank you for the 10,000 coins, chat. I do appreciate it. Oh, it does hinge? I like the song She-Wolf. She-Wolf was one of my favorite songs back in the day. I'll give you that. one of her best. It's so like subtly eat electro pop. Great song. Oh, woo. I love how she didn't even try with the howling. Interstellar strut with the 28 freaking wow. months. I appreciate that so much. Thank you. Thank you. It's great to see you, as usual. <laughs> I can't win with my chat. I can't win. Oh. Not the red hair while I'm waiting in the rain. I like how the rain sound just cuts out. Oh, I have one more of these. All right, let's break open the sad turds. Ooh, two turds. This is not naturally red hair. This is, this is Ronald McDonald wig hair. 
This is not naturally red hair. That's my opinion! Okay, we do need to give a lot of those to Gunther. Why are you just standing in the rain, silly? Why are you judging me? For digging through the trash? Her yelling at me for digging through the trash says more about her. Think about it. <laughs> think, think about it. Think about it. Why are you whining? That's just my voice. I think you're just mistaking it for my voice. Yeah, you can find great stuff in the trash. Squids? Octopies? Um... Pizzas? Well, you'll probably get timed out if you do that, Cat. I'll just tell you now. Thank you for the coal. <laughs> why am I whining? That's like asking why am I gay. <laughs> that just comes with it. That's just part of it. We've got a lot of inquisitive people in here today, I'll tell you that much. We got a lot of inquisitive folks in here today, I'll tell you that. <laughs> not, not I'm Aquarius. I'm gonna put this urn somewhere. We're gonna pretend like the chat's in that urn. <laughs> and I'll put the bear statue peeking out from behind the house. That's gonna be fun. a lot of questions going on today. Maybe it's time we all look inward. Whatever happened to looking inward? About the mayo sandwich? I don't even remember the mayo sandwiches story. Okay, Strawberry has redeemed us. Say nice things about the chat. Which is not like I haven't been doing that all straight. Thank you for the reverb fart, Mia Asthma. I appreciate it. Dear chat, if y'all were... Hmm, if y'all were a type of desert animal, you would be a armadillo. Because they can protect themselves from things. Like hit like stepping if you accidentally stepped on them which no one would do on purpose but if you accidentally did that um for example if a um lizard stepped on you and you could roll up in a little ball and you could be home wherever you are is home Uh, de and dear chat. Yeah, we are having a high ponytail moment here. And y'all are just spawning some stuff, huh? I got the fast sword. No one can stop me. I ain't, I ain't even hating on this ghost. Oh, ow. <laughs> oh, ow. Ooh. <laughs> Not moisturize. Oh, how did I switch to that? Armadillos are like kind of soft, right? Aren't they? I don't think you're supposed to touch them. Are they the ones that have leprosy? That wasn't part of the nice thing, but there's one of those things you're not supposed to touch because they have leprosy. I'm over that ghost. Whoever sent that ghost, you win. <laughs> Whoever sent that ghost, you win. Okay, I hated it. Oh, 
My nose is so itchy, y'all. It really is so itchy today. I'm allergic to those types of trees where the bark peels. And the bark, those trees are everywhere. And Piggy will like walk around those trees and then kiss me. <laughs> and I have an itchy nose the rest of the day. Do you know what I'm talking about? The trees where the bark peels off? Not this. Oh, this is a heavy sword. Armadillos always give birth to twins? Not trees after they get a sunburn. Okay, I gotta get, I have to get out of here. Oh! They tried to get me. <sighs> Ron, I don't know what you just typed. City Redneck, thank you for the four months. I do appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Not Monica changing the username to Monica is awful. Monica going fully Black Mirror season six. Streamberry, now on Streamberry, Monica is awful. <laughs> Now streaming on Streamberry. I love it. We love to see it. Oh, Monica, who would play you? Who would play her? Who would play me? Alf, the puppet. <laughs> who would play me on... Half Moon Joe was awful. Alf, the puppet. Uh, Barney. <laughs> yeah, Alf. Okay, Farville, what's this say? Thank you for the bits. You had an English teacher who ate four sandwiches with nothing but mayo and washing down with Sunny D. She had no neck. How did she, the sandwiches go down if she didn't have a neck? But what? I don't know what that is. All right, well, I've now read that. <laughs> And I'm not sure my life is the better for it. Oh, I had no change. <laughs> well, I've now read that, what you wrote. So, a problem shared is a problem cut in half, okay? So, I hope you're feeling better. A problem shared is a problem cut in half. All right, these things are gonna get me killed. I can only focus on this serpent. Um, Ashlyn57, thank you for the two months, by the way. I really appreciate it. It's great to see you. Oh no, five months, did I say two? Thank you so much. Problem shared is a problem cut in half. That flying serpent sure did not come back. It's still over there somewhere on the other side of the screen.
Yeah, awful sometimes feels like it needs to have an E in it. The mines have really been giving us this map. They said just walk to the end. No. No. I'm just here for the journey. health do these things have? <laughs> no. In fact, we might block the words B-movie. <laughs> what year did the B-movie come out? Like 2004? Seven? Really? Why does this ghost have a receding hairline? Like, I mean, that's fine. Real, real, recognize real. You know, I, I relate to this ghost. But it is an interesting choice. I didn't think the other ones had that. The balding ghost <laughs> is my ghost. that ghost. I thought maybe he'd give me a prismatic shard, but he sure didn't. That guy wasn't even really trying to kill me. He just stood right in front of me. Now he's trying to kill me. Oh, perfect. Well, I don't always need to talk. Sometimes I can just look at the chat and I see some things that y'all have said and they don't always require responses. And there have been some of those moments today. It's a Monday, I get it. We're all a little sassy. It's a Monday, I get it. I can be fun. I can let loose. <laughs> I was so done with the skull. Oh my god, it's 9.20 p.m. I think I go to bed. Oh, look, Finnick Foxes! Old Sap, thank you for that reverb fart. I do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Welcome joke, I wanna hear it. What joke did you say that was so bad? Wait, I also want to know, was it like a relatively empty chat? I want to know what you said and if it was in like a relatively empty chat. That would make it worse. I wish the mouse wouldn't move up there. That's the one thing about this mod we're really discovering. Finnick foxes! They're in the desert, aren't they? Wait, who are you to tell a fox where it should live? Why are my chests so huge? Because I treated myself to a mod that has an infinite chest. Because I said I'm done with chests 
in my vanilla version of this game on the Switch, I have about 20 chests I'm a hoarder. And I said, not this one. And I said, let's just vibe. Wait, did we ever hear what the joke was? It was an empty chat. I can't even explain, but it was about the new Final Fantasy game. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Even if you were there. Thank you for me winning the lottery. I rhymed the character's name as Chive and Dill. Oof. Oh, this same tree got struck. This one probably gets struck. It's very close to the battery power thing. How long can it take to build a coop? How much can a chicken coop cost? Ten dollars? God, thank you for this upgrade to this fucking thing. That is wonderful. Alright, chat, what are we doing today? Fishing? Let me tell you, if you want to be surrounded by like-minded people who have said things in this chat that have not gone over well, you're in great company. How many people are here? 265. Raise your hand if you've ever said something really dumb in this chat. <laughs> Raise your hands. We sure didn't do the bundles for spring, but it's summer already. Wait, we did. I don't remember if I completed the fishing I was supposed to do, though. <laughs> Not this, Brit Steps. Whitney, good to see you. Thank you for the bits again. Get them repaired. Or per oh, no. I hope they magically start working again. I feel like that sometimes happens with my earbuds. So I'm sending you like, I'm sending you healing vibes for the earbuds. Yeah, we're not doing great on the bundles. I'll tell you that. We did not get five gold parsnips for spring. So. Wait, can I put, no. Does this mod let me move stuff over? Or has this already been here? I don't know. We did all that. Now the fish tank is another story. Spring, fall, winter. Fish and ocean, summer, fall. So we got time for these. Summer, fall. I should try to get a... We'll try to get a tilapia. I think Alex was the first one I married in the game. Alex, and then I divorced him and married Shane, and then uh, Harvey's where... Harvey has my heart, though. Fall and winter. And then this is spring, fall. Okay. I, for I forgot I had this mod where it shows me the stuff when to fish. So I'm actually pretty good for 
I mean, I could catch this tilapia, but I have next month, too. Actually, we're... We're doing pretty good. Yeah, not too shabby. I'm just going to bed today, though. I want that chicken coop done. I want to buy some chickens. Now, chat, should we put up a fence or free range? Chat, free range chickens. The risk, sometimes they get eaten by animals and the other chickens get traumatized. Is that a risk we were willing to take? Oh, I don't pet the chickens. The chickens are fine. Um, I do believe that uh, something can happen where the chickens get snatched. Let me look at my inventory real quick. I keep thinking I need these fucking peppers and I don't, so I need to stop dwelling on these fucking... Not me watering that bear in the bear in the bin. Just poured water on that bear in the bin. Alright, today we will purchase... Shane, li Shane likes the peppers. But we have pizzas for him, so it's okay. The Santa Claus looking dude? Are you talking about Willy? Wait. Who's Monica talking about? Oh, Linus? <laughs> Monica's talking about Linus. Okay. Well, he's not romanceable. He lives in a tent and uh, and chooses to live in a tent, he says. It's only, oh, if you close the tent door. Oh, the door. Well, I'll just leave the door open. Then the fox can get in as well. Oh, Farville, thank you for the bits. I don't remember this. Bamboozle, thank you for the three months. Great to see you. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. I like Linus. Not as a as a dating partner. But he's a good character. Alright, we'll just leave it open. That'll be fine. Let me tell you, wait till Sam's dad gets into town. What's his name? What's Sam's dad's name? Why can't you break... And the big question, why can't you break him and Jody up? Kent. Okay, I know. Kent, Kent is not great. He sends you bombs in the mail. But he's hot. He sends you bombs in the mail. Mama, they can't all be winners. They can't all be perfect. <laughs> yeah, Kent will occasionally send you... Yeah, they're useful in the game. In the game, he'll occasionally send you bombs in the mail. Okay. No, <laughs> I can fix them. All right, let's get some chickens. All right, what are we naming the chicken? <laughs> no, I can make him worse. All right, what do y'all want to name the chicken? Joe stopped the game to nerve his statement about opening a hole and spilling. <laughs> this is you changed, Fartville? <laughs> I'm sorry. Thank you for the bits. Oh, I got it. 
the chat. Since we don't have the frog anymore. Since we don't have the frog anymore, because I hated it. Oop. Put a Q on the end. Okay. So it's check, check. All right. And I want to upgrade that coop as well because I want to I want to put that dinosaur egg in there ASAP. Yeah, it's, fr it's French. <laughs> exactly, Casey. It's French. Shock. How much to upgrade the coop? $10,000, which I have, unless y'all take it away. 400 wood and 150 stone. I see y'all have spawned a serpent. God, I wasn't watching. <laughs> oh, and you made me slow. Okay, okay. <laughs> Not your chat cue. Why do these things keep flying off screen and not coming back? I think I'm hitting them real hard. This sword must have a lot of... Okay, I guess he's going to stay on the farm for a while. This sword has a lot of pushback. Oh, shit. How much wood do I need? 400. I don't have enough wood to upgrade it. Boy, chicken. So it comes with the incubator once I upgrade, though. So we really need to be trying to get more wood. What happened to all the wood? Why did my aunt turn on the fucking oven again? <laughs> Monica, what's going on over there? Oh, thank you for the wood. Oh, yay, we're getting a lot of wood now. Thank y'all so much. 15 wood. I'll go deforest, though. Y'all don't worry. I'm going to do some deforestation as well. Thank you for all this wood. Oh, I just heard one of the wild froggies. There's a bush there. God, I love giving wood. My nose is so itchy. Allergic reaction literally live on stream. Whitney, I'm glad you got to pop back in. Thank you again for the bits. Hope the rest of your day goes well. Oh, that tree had a lot of butterflies in it. Um, I tagged a monarch butterfly once. We had this thing in middle school. They gave you the stickers and you reported it if you tagged it. I don't really know whatever happened to mine. I didn't really follow it. But they tag them for their migration and stuff. I think I stickered one. It's so nice having this axe for this. This is what I'm talking about, y'all helping with the game. Bye, Greek boy, sleep well. A milkweed grow for the butter. Is that what they like? One time, when we were kids, oh, let's talk mods, let's talk Luna mods. One time when we were kids living out in the country, um, 
I still don't have 400, but we are very close. A Luna Moth. Huge, by the way. The big old ones. Landed on my sister's bedroom window, and we thought it was an alien. Um, I know someone who's gotten a moth stuck in their ear. They aren't here right now, I don't think. Not Stan Luna mods. Thought it was an alien. No, bugs crawling in the ears is like horror movie. Yeah, they can just crawl in there and then they don't come out and you have to go to the doctor. Oh, chat. Here's one more thing we can do down here. Do y'all want me to get the baby bonnet? <laughs> do y'all want me to wear the baby bonnet and say things like poopy down my leg? I haven't been wearing hats because y'all can change my uh, hair in, in the with money. <laughs> no. Gigi, thank you for the bits. Are those the ones that are, um... No, there's some kind of moth right now. They're telling everyone to kill because it's not no. native. <laughs> Shay TV, thank you for that. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Um... Lantern? Is it lan is lantern flies? Is that a moth? There's some kind of thing that they're saying that are, are infil infiltrating the government. I don't know. That might be fake news. I don't, I don't, I read headlines. I don't actually read the thing. Not fucking millipedes. Oh, it's a, it's a fly. Alright, I've got enough wood now. Did I get my stone out? I sure didn't. Okay. Oh, I think it's too late to go to Robin's. Okay, well, we'll go to bed. And then we'll have her upgrade the coop. And then we'll put the dinosaur egg in there. Oh, where's the chicken? Oh, I left it closed in there. Alright, well, I guess I should go see the chicken that we got. Oop. The chat seems curious, but a little cautious. She's getting used to the new home. Oh, I don't have any food for it either. That's okay. <laughs> It'll eat the grass. It'll come outside and eat the grass tomorrow when it's not raining. They'll figure it out. The <laughs> about to stop. Well, here's the thing. The animals can't die in Stardew Valley. Nobody... Animals don't die unless, I guess, they get taken by a creature. But that's not going to happen either. So y'all don't need to worry. Oh. <laughs> you know what? I'll leave that rock on the table. It symbolizes my, in my real life rock collection. It turns out, art imitates life. Boggy's doing great. Boggy's thriving. He's sleeping indoors. My knee's acting up. And you know what hoops? Rubbing it with a hot pepper. All right. Homophobic George wants a hot pepper. I think we should have another harvest before summer. I don't know. I don't care. I don't really like George. I like this rain. Don't have to water the crops. Well, 
you know, I can see where George is coming from with like stump water. Like stump water is where I'm at. I don't think that's the truth, Ryan. Wait, on Thursdays, do they do yoga? There's one day where they all have an exercise class. So that might be today. Well, we'll check our phone while we're waiting. And we can see if my, um, if my Amazon order arrived. Arriving today by 10 p.m. I got a MagSafe wallet to go with the MagSafe ring. So when I don't have on the MagSafe pop socket, I can take it off and put my wallet on. Well, oh, I'm bald. Not like, it's not so much yoga. I think they do like weights and stuff. Oh, it's Tuesdays. Okay, good. Uh-oh. There's a toad. It's the, it's the ghost of the chat come crawling back. <laughs> yeah, I got one of those little MagSafe sticker rings. <laughs> chat crawling back to me. Oh, we'll talk to him while we wait for this house to open. Is it raining in D.C. yet? Anyone looking out the window in D.C.? Anyone have a, a looking out the window? It's not as raining in Florida. windows. I have to keep them closed during the stream, though. Not I hear rain coming from the stream. It's raining outside, but I'm not in D.C. Not this Wonder Girls. Oh, yeah, 73. You need air conditioning. Okay, Monica's been the closest so far. Best I can do is is rain it in Stardew. You know what? I'll take it. I'll take that. I might have actually got enough fucking corn for this fucking thing. I need five gold corn and I sure just fucking did it. Hell yeah. Not 91. I think today's a 90 degree day. Now, where's Buffalo? I can't see wet. I can't feel wet. Adam, thank you so much. You're in DC. Oh, I'm gonna pick out this one. It's bright and sunny. It's bright and sunny. It's supposed to, like, rain and thunder and storm and hail later, isn't it? I don't like that. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think, I don't think 109 is the move. Oh my god. Justin talks about the dew point all the time. Buffalo's Oh, it's near Niagara Falls. Okay. So what's up uh, up at the over there? It's up and over there. Arkansas rainstorms were the move. I really enjoyed a rainstorm.
Not do point circle. <laughs> That's a good joke. I'll tell you, the summer that I had the internship at the fashion magazine in New York, New York City, um, they were, you know, they shoot photo shoots ahead of time, and so they were doing, like, the fur issue, and I had to, I was running around New York City carrying, like, ten furs, five on each arm, and it was, like, 90-something degrees. Let me tell you, that was not the move. Sorry to those models who had to wear those. Actually, they were in plastic bags. New York City. Not <laughs> that. <laughs> not okay. Not okay. I'm sleeping through these past few days of summer in the game, by the way. Oh. Do you ever pick up your rocks? You look at your rocks. You show your dog the rock. Put the rock back on the table, then you go to bed at 12.30 p.m. Because you can do that in Stardew Valley. Well, I will say, sometimes we had to, like, return jewelry. And they would tape it. They would tape the bag to your arm. So you, so it would have to get cut off when it was there. Not your hand get cut off, but the bag get cut off your arm when you got there. We, I think we may have hit a record in subs. Where are we at? 1,200! We may, hold on, let me see how many actually, um, so sub points is a different thing. We have 1,330 sub points, and so that equals, like, people who are tier 2 subs equal 2 sub points. I guess, well, we were riding, like, the subway and stuff, so, yeah, we would have, like, the stuff taped to us. I only remember that happening once or twice. But, I mean, I guess you're dealing with tens of thousands of dollars. Thousands, if not tens of thousands of dollars of merchandise. It was wild. I love the... I love the butt emote with the little hand. I think that's neat. All right, how's... is Robin in here working? It hadn't been a dry day since we got this chicken. Where's my chicken? Which... oh, there it is! <laughs> oh, it's pissed! The chat is looking a little thin! Oh my god, skin cheese! <laughs> Oh my god, so skinty! Thank you for the thousand coins. <laughs> Louder than life. Oh, I like the sunglasses too. It looks like he's peeking over the sunglasses. Gigi, thank you again for the bit. Buffalo, I think that's how the one dollar from seventh heaven was banished to Buffalo. <laughs> Not seventh heaven. I think I need a tuna. I'm gonna take the tuna. Oh, I need a... <gasps> oh! Wait, did y'all just take all my money? Or did I just spend it poorly? You're kidding me. I need the tilapia. Oh, did I just spend an awful amount of money on that tuna? I might have just spent a horrible amount of money on the tuna. Uh, Glass with a fat ass. You would like to address the Omaha, Nebraska... Oh, thank you, old sap. I appreciate that. Now we get to have tilapia. Oh, thank you, Monica and Gigi. We get to have tilapia now. Thank y'all so much. And that was rhubarb. 
It's a Thanksgiving miracle. Okay, glass with the fat ass. Now, what'd you want to say about Omaha? You said you wanted to address the Omaha in the room? The floor's open. <laughs> Thanks, old sap. Oh, I like that he can face both ways. I almost feel like I need to make the ass chunkier. Yeah, the horse is an eggplant. It sure is. I should probably have... Oh, did I not even need the tuna? I already had a tuna, didn't I? So I wasted my money on the... There's the tuna. We already had the tuna. That's okay, I'll eat the tuna. That's okay, I'll eat the tuna. Not butts touching. I think in the next stream, well, I'll probably end in just a second. But um, then we'll get to watch the moonlight. Next episode is going to be very emotional because we're going to watch the Moonlight Jellies together. Ooh, thank you for the lava katana. Best zoo in the world, downtown Omaha, small enough you can drive. You lost me a drive. I don't like driving. I heard there aren't even any mountains, though. Is that true? Oh my gosh, go to a concert. I'm going to a concert in New York. Uh, I don't remember when Justin got tickets. <laughs> I'll save the tuna. I thought Nebraska was mountains. I don't really like concerts, but Justin will get tickets if he knows it's a concert I get to sit down at, and I'll approve of that. If I get to sit down at the concert, I'm good. I'm gonna hold the dinosaur egg so I remember that we're gonna use it. Oh, see, ours is like seated. It's like orchestral, orchestral, orchestral. Um, so we're going to be seated and I'm going to be, um, vibed. Um, not the symphony. Wait, is the Moonlight Jellies not now? Is that winter? When are the Moonlight Jellies? Is that tomorrow? We'll have a look. Well, I'm not going to complete this day. The 28th of summer. Oh, okay. So it is tomorrow. I guess we'll get a letter. We'll complete summer in the next episode. Dino egg, moonlight jellies. And we're going to give grandpa his hot pepper. Yeah, that'll be a good thing. What slaps? 
Oh, are we talking about concerts? Oh, concerts. Concerts. Summer concerts. <laughs> I know bands. I thought Thundercats was a cartoon. Oh, does he want pepper jelly? No, he just wants pepper, right? Knee therapy. Oh, just a hot pepper. Pepper jelly is so good. I love pepper jelly. You can get it in West Virginia. Thank you for the pizza. To work the world to our health. Oh, it sounds like fun. Okay, that is going to be all for today. Um, stay tuned. Oh, we didn't even talk about the schedule for this week, y'all. This week, we're going to be having what we in the industry call fun. Let me put it up on the screen. What's this week? June? June 26? Check this out. Okay, today happened, which was Stardew Valley with crowd control. Tomorrow, Mystery Case Files more return to Ravenhurst. We're going to be locked underground with ghosts. Wednesday, no stream. Thursday, Detroit Become Human. Y'all requested this, so we're going to be playing as cyborgs and trying to become human. Making choices. And then Friday, Slumber Party in the evening. Might still do a daytime stream. I'm not sure yet, but for sure, Slumber Party Easy Bake. We're going to be making our own pizzas at the Slumber Party in the Bratz Easy Bake Oven. You guessed it. You guessed it in the Bratz Easy Bake Oven. Today happened. <laughs> Oh no! Oh. <laughs> Our time has come to an end for today. Thank y'all so much for being here. Thank you for the bits, donations, subs, gift subs, wonderful Patreon patrons. Y'all are freaking awesome. Y'all are the reason I can keep doing this. Um, stay tuned for tomorrow for more mysteries, cases, and files. Stay hydrated. Take care of yourselves. Exhibit self-care. Love y'all so much. I'll see you tomorrow.